Bonjour tout le monde, hello everyone, hope you all are well. This video is the second part to the Final Cut Pro editing and in this video I'm going to show you a bit of how I make my Bebop 2 videos look similar to that of videos that came out of my DSLR. So putting all the Bebop videos plus the DSLR videos into one video and making them look the same. In the previous video we went over using the color correction, the saturation exposure to create a cinematic look. Also using the teal and orange to give you that offset on the colors. So now just to recap with the exposure settings we usually push the shadows up the highlights down and the midtones down to give it that cinematic look that film and also recover a bit of dynamic range in the image in the saturation tab of color correction i always like to have a bit of saturation in the mids and the shadows but desaturate the highlights and this is because it will really complement that cinematic look. Once we are happy with our settings and our colors and the image entirely, we can now copy the settings and you can do this with the command plus C key. Once you do that, you go to your drone footage and highlight the drone footage by clicking on it and then command shift V. That is command shift v and then you can select the settings and adjustments that you want to paste there once you have pasted your video settings onto the drone footage the footage will now look like your dslr footage you can also just go through them and see if they match up if they don't you can adjust them usually you just adjust the exposure because that's the only thing that would be really different as far as the auto white balance they would be around the same area so the colors are going to be the same if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you don't, give me a thumbs down. Until next time, fly safe and God bless.